Hello everyone, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Today we're in SCS's uh, T680. We're in Carson City. We got a NASCAR hauler here. I don't know why it's at Best Buy, but okay. With a race car. We're heading down to Bakersfield, California. We got 390 miles to go. Down to Tesla. The truck has a Cummins N14 with an 18 speed eating full transmission. Okay, let's get on the road. Now, I wanted uh, to make a video and discuss what NCS did uh, announce in their latest um, stream. They did do a stream um, Wednesday um, of what's coming for the next update for American Truck for 1.7. To talk about it, you know, let people know if you did not see the stream, um, I did watch it. So, I do know, uh, I don't know everything, but I do know the most important stuff was um, they are releasing the window update where you will be able to roll the windows down in the truck. And they're releasing uh, Z Mod which is a, mod, a sound mod, which is going to fix a lot of the sound issues, um, stuff like that, for the game, which is going to be pretty cool. We are getting one new trailer, it's going to be our own operator trailer, it's going to be a, a food trailer, like a tanker. Go straight on. And uh, yet, excuse the, um, a little bit of a lag, uh, G4 still has not updated their drives and it's not doing the best right now. It's okay, but it's not doing good to good to good. Um, yeah, we are getting one new trailer, which is, um, it's like a, a food trailer like a tanker, light of milk, um, olive oil. Not really sure everything that will be included. They did say milk. They did run a load with milk uh, on the live stream. Uh, they added a new fuel gauge and temperature gauge to the trucks. I hit the button. First button didn't hit the button. There we go. Close that up. We don't need that on. So if everyone's doing well, I do appreciate Go everyone that, is, that has uh, been watching left. the videos. I do apologize for not getting uploads like I want. Um, if you ha do not know, we do have a America Truck Summer Facebook group, which is doing very well. Uh, if you'd like to join, feel free to do so. If you play this game. Uh, this is one thing, too, that they said that, that would probably would be fixed as a, in the video. It would still work. But they said that's probably something that they will be removing, is where you can look out the window like this with the window up. Um... As you know, it, you know, it was in the beta, and that's another thing, the beta is available. 1.37 beta is now out, it is, it is available. For anyone that wants to try it out. Me personally, I normally wait until um, it comes out of beta before I do it. Before I play it. I don't normally play betas too much. <coughs> Still have all Jazzy Cat's traffic mods in. Look at that old Camaro right there. What is that? A, I don't like a, a 
Charger or a Challenger sitting there? Pretty cool. Nothing but red light so far. Uh, this trip is about the shortest one I could find, guys. This is about 390 miles. Uh, about as short as I can find. Uh, I do recommend if, if you're new to this game and you want to get a good start, with some money. Uh, this trailer here will make you money. This one load right here is about two hundred thousand dollars. With this uh and this trailer is found on the workshop. The engines that I'm using is on the workshop. As I said, this is a SCS truck. Um, I don't use too many modded trucks. I do occasionally. Not much. Uh, I think we'll go ahead and get a thumbnail. And get that over with. Have the truck with this trailer. I didn't really paint the trailer. I just left it like it was. Just for this one. Didn't put a texture in it. I started to, too, but I didn't. Get in a little closer. That'll work. On this rainy day. Alright. Get back on the road. the bus guys so how's everyone doing i hope everyone's been enjoying the, the content um you know, things have kind of slowed down um i'm still hoping to get more out this year i'm really hoping to see what SCS is going to do with this game i mean you know we, obviously we have idaho this coming i mean iowa this coming idaho, excuse me um there's been some very strong information that the Mac may be coming very soon. Um, obviously, SCS did not uh, release that information, but that's just kind of been what's, uh, what's been said. You know, where well, you think they'll go from there? You think they'll go to Texas? I mean, you think they'll do Wyoming? Uh, yeah. Let me know. I'm interested. I'm, and uh, you know, getting back to the truck. So, I play um, a lot of games with mods, um, you know, like LSPD Far. You know, LSPD Far is basically all mods, cars, you know, everything in is mods. And I have nothing against modders. I, I think modders do a great job. I think they, you know, like the modders for this, the modders for LSPD Far, they, they all do a great job. Their mods. Uh, but when it comes to this game, I would prefer a truck like this right here. Nothing against the mods now. I do run modded trucks occasionally. Um, I get this question I asked all the time. I do run modded trucks occasionally. But I, I prefer this more than I do a uh, a modded truck because as I've said before companies most of them this is what they buy stock just like this right here 
me, they wouldn't even have an engine like what's in this one. This one has 605 horses coming. Most of them, you know, they buy uh, just from the fact that whatever right they put in. And then continue straight on. So, I mean, it Go straight on. But you know, so, but yes, uh, like I said, we do have an LL, uh, excuse me, American Truck Summit on Facebook group, for anyone that is interested in joining. We're, all, we're always looking for new members for, the, for our group. Um, you know, we post videos, we post photos over there. The group's doing very well, I'm very happy to see how it's doing. Uh, and it shows the passion for this game. And the passion for what you know, SES and other modders have done for this game and this community. You know. um, so, and I wish this bus would go on so we can get down the road. We got 318 miles to go. We've been behind this bus. Um, really? Uh, another feature that they did announce uh, in the video is you would now be able to walk around in your garage. You will have a new custom garage screen when you're customizing your um, trailer or your truck you would now be able to walk around and get up close to all the parts um, and really look at what you're doing that's something that's going to be added for using the um, the highway patrol police mod it's on the workshop now it does not work in the new states it only works in the existing states um, you know California Arizona Nevada but you know that's okay at least it does work That's a little wild too, guys. I, I want to know if it's wild. I had to adjust my microphone there. Once again, I am using a Xbox One controller. I do not have a wheel for this game. And that is something that they did say in the live stream that you will have to set up a key for each window once um, um, 
throw the, your windows down. Because they won't have a key assigned to them. They did say that. Still stuck behind this bus in traffic here. We got a bus and two trucks ahead of us and they're running slow. Ah, I hit the button again. We're 200, 237, 36 miles. Sorry about that, I keep hitting the wrong button, guys. Just kind of being quiet, enjoying this, the view in this game, listening to that Cummins. Doing his job. I guess we're going to ride behind this bus all the way to Bakersfield.
Yeah, now, and one thing too guys I want to say, uh, driving this game with a controller is a lot different from a wheel. You don't have to, you know, you have to brake more with this controller than you would a wheel. With stuff like this. I will be posting um, a video for Monday. There probably will be a LSP Park video. Uh, may even do a live stream of a uh, of American Truck Monday. I'm not positive yet. Depends on what I have to do. Um, as I've said, it is, I do have a full-time job, so sometimes it's hard to get in here and record like I want to. I wish I could. But that is what I want to do. I would love to make this my full-time job. at 164 miles. Um, not really too much as of right now that is, uh, has been listed to come of a PC that I want to look at. Um, mostly I get all my stuff from Steam. I don't really use too many other launchers, only Steam. So mostly what I play is on Steam. And as of right now, there's not really nothing on Steam. New. But, uh... Looks like be interested to look at. Rainy day. Yep. So, um, you know, who's going to be happy for the uh, new update for Mac Control? You know, the, the window uh, update's going to be um, great to see. Uh, they did say that the Z mod, or F mod, excuse me, is already available on their site. 
if you want to try it out, it's, it is already available. You kind of get used to it on their blog. Me, I'm going to wait for it to come out. Bush. Right run over that bush. He won't stop the road. Uh, the F mod is a, will be built into the game. You will have sliders. Uh, they did show that to adjust your sound, all your sounds and stuff you know, for the game when it comes out for the update. Oh, this bus is finally turning, it looks like. Good. We got a two lane, we can get around them. We'll leave that up for now. We got 124 miles, so we'll just go ahead and leave that up. Like I said, um, I think we just, uh, discussed everything, uh, what they did say that uh, will be in the update. Yeah, the biggest thing, like, like we've already said, will be the window update and the sounds. That's something, you know, that a lot of us have been wanting them to address, is the sounds. Um, and that's something that they are doing. They're using a traffic mod. I'm not using one off the workshop. This is something that one of my members over on the uh, our Facebook group, he linked in the group, tried it out. It's a, it's a pretty good traffic mod so far.
Like we may be getting on the interstate over here. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Yep, we're heading to Bakersfield. Oh, hush, we're almost there. Customer inspecting the delivery. I wish there was a way to turn that off, I really do. Oh, they no CHP out. Bakersfield, guys. Go straight on. Sorry, but I don't know what that is. Don't know why it froze, guys. Got to be a mod. I have to look into that. It wasn't doing that. Could be this traffic mod too. Causing issues. Keep left and then turn left. Turn left.
We are using the real company's mod. It's on the workshop. That's what gives us the Tesla dealership. Me personally, I'd rather see a, a different dealership than Tesla, but you know. You have arrived at your destination. Your wrap guidance is now finished. All right. Let's see where they want this. Want it back in that corner. Get over here when you straighten it up a little bit. Um, I don't, <coughs> excuse me, I don't use tractor R or anything like that. So it's just easier for me to back trailers like this. I know it's not realistic. Here we go. All right, we drove excellent. We drove 391 miles. It took us 10 hours and 36 minutes to get here. We consumed 53.6 gallons of fuel. And we'll look at Bakersfield and see what uh, we got to pick up here. I think we'll run, I'm going to run that on my next load. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. Want to get in here and get do a short video and uh, let one know what that shit is to talk about in the update.
It will be coming out the 1.7, uh, 1.37 update that's coming out. The new features that we will see. I want to say thank you for watching. Thank you for enjoying the videos. And thank you for subscribing. Have a good afternoon.